Jack in the Box is back at it again with their donut bites, but this time they got a fruity flavor. What's good, Schmack Pack? It's your boy, Roderick, at Jack in the Box, because they brought back their donut holes. But not only that, they actually got a new flavor. They originally had the cinnamon sugar ones, which I actually thoroughly enjoyed, but now they have fruity milk cereal flavor. That's a very weird way of saying fruity pebbles, isn't it? All I know is it looked cool in the picture, so I had to try it out, and here they are. Ooh, they're really warm. They do smell fruity. Oh, I can't wait. All right, now let's get a peek on inside. Oh, look at them things. Oh, they looking good. Except that one on the left doesn't look like it's coated with anything. So I'm not sure what's going on. But the rest, they look aight. Oh, they do resemble some... They almost smell like Fruit Loops. They kind of remind me of those Carl's Jr. Fruit Loop donuts. Looks like we have some powder in there at the bottom. Let me do a little shake. Try to get it coated up as much as possible. These are served warm, so hopefully it'll stick. Oh, ho, 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 they look a lot better. But don't take my word for it. You can take a look for yourself. Look at that coating. Oh, now let's pull it on out. Ooh, nice and warm. Oh, this thing is definitely coated with some sugary goodness. Oh, yeah, look at that. We got some rainbow flakes in there, a lot of white sugary coating. Oh, this is looking good. I actually think they're the exact same donuts as the cinnamon sugar ones. They just put a different coating on top, which isn't necessarily a bad thing, although I feel like these would be a little bit better if they were cake donuts. I wonder what this coating tastes like, though. Woo. Okay, we do have some Fruit Loop flavor action. All that sugar really coats your tongue. It's pretty dense. But how does it taste all together? It is confirmed. These are the exact same donuts as their cinnamon sugar ones with a fruity coating this time. And they are warm and fluffy on the inside, so I'm not complaining. Oh, this one right here has some coating overload. This one's going to be packed with some flavor. You know what? We got to do this all in one bite this time. Fingers crossed I don't die. Cinnamon challenge! Oh, except I didn't get the cinnamon ones, but fruity challenge! Well, definitely stronger. Now, these aren't really the fruitiest things in the world. When you eat it with the donut, the donut definitely overpowers that fruity flavor, but they do taste good overall. Oh, you can taste some milk, too. Oh boy, look at that. We got a lot of extra milk and fruity crumbles down here at the bottom of the bag. If you really wanted to, you can dump this stuff on your fries, but you know what, I wanna taste it a little bit more. Yep, definitely milky and fruity. On a scale of one to 10, Jack in the Box's new fruity cereal milk donut bites, oh, they definitely slap. They're good, they're hot, they're fresh, they're fluffy, they're yummy. The milk and fruit flavor is there. Not super strong like Carl's Jr.'s Fruit Loop donuts, but those ones had the fruit going throughout. These are just regular plain donuts with a little bit of coating on the outside. The coating does get a bit overpowered by the actual dough of the donuts, but it overall tastes good. Just not super fruity, super milky when you eat it all together. Personally, I do definitely prefer the cinnamon sugar ones over these, because it is a weird combination. It does work, but it's just not the best combination. Like I was saying, these would be a little bit better if they were cake donuts and had the fruity goodness throughout, but it is what it is. And the good thing is they could have a bunch of different coatings coming for all we know, and then just keep putting them on top of the same donuts. Maybe we'll get some chocolate, some maple, some caramel, whatever. You guys let me know what flavor you want to see, and let me know if you guys tried these ones out for yourself. Thumbs up, red subscribe button, get that merch, social media, and I'll see y'all in the next one.